great. We did T-ball this morning. Yeah. And then, and now we have like the, the, the majors, which is 11 through 15. So we gotta have you throw out a ceremonial I'll first pitch. I'll yep. do it. I'll do it. Pretty cool. I'm Pretty cool. Excited. I think you might be our first ceremonial first pitch. <laughs> Danny, you want to tell us a little bit about the Roosevelt Island Little League? Absolutely. So Ari and I have been running it for five years now. Uh, it's a nonprofit league. It's totally free. Uh, 200 plus kids uh, some years on, on the island and off island come to play in this league. Um, and it's really been a, a, a gem of the community. I feel like I grew up here, played in the league myself, and it had a very profound impact on me as a kid. And now it's a privilege to run it as well with, with Aria, who comes from Queens and brings his kids. and. Uh, has made an amazing impact on the island too. So it's, I think it's an amazing program. Actually. Thank you. Yeah, and we were able to, obviously, along with almost every other activity, we were shuttered in 2020. And then, you know, kind of brought it back last year with certain safety precautions. And it was really, at the risk of sounding too dramatic, it was really kind of a healing experience for everybody. Us being able to be out here and have the lead after, after the year that everybody had. So, and just based on, especially what we did last year, uh, uh, we've had great momentum. And the community, again, as Danny said, our numbers just keep growing as you know as to the kids who want to learn baseball and then hopefully play you know during you know as they grow up so it's, it's a great thing kind of you know great thing to fall into my life as danny said i'm off island so i kind of you know fell into this uh and it's just a great you know what what better what better way to spend a beautiful spring day than out here you know with kids of all ages playing baseball yeah so it's a real treat That's great. Yeah. what do you think council member Mendes? i'm so happy to be here we were thrilled to be a sponsor of this it's so important to have the kids out here having fun playing sports learning great life lessons so we're thrilled to be a small part of this yeah that's what baseball is a fantastic metaphor for life <laughs> and that's the fabric and and culture that we build in our league so we're grateful to have your support doing it yeah. and not only baseball but team sports yes actually you know this is baseball but just team sports and especially at a young age having these kids kind of practicing every week and having this kind of collective sense of improvement and collective sense of accomplishment and really again you know starting in april and then you know developing the confidence uh in the game come june and you really see the results on the field so it's really nice to see these teams kind of really take the concept of teamwork the way the way it's supposed to be and what are the uh, age groups explosions. the age groups so we go all day long we start at 9 a.m with the t-ball guys five and six years old we go you just saw the minors division yep. seven to ten year olds and now the big guns come in the 11 to the 14 big guns. Ones, we're right? ready for them so let's do it they, they, this it gets progressively a little more competitive as it goes on great again great parents dedicated coaches here's jimmy senior one of the longest running veteran coaches in the game He's a, whis a pitcher whisperer. He knows how to get to through to them. Uh, and this is really a, a lot of people show up for the last games, and it's a lot of fun. There's Isaiah, all-star team Isaiah. Don't be bashful. Don't be bashful. <laughs> so, yeah.